a neurodivergent colleague who was told they needed a neurodivergent student needed to teach a neurodivergent student how to behave like a normal human being in May of 21 since left the district and she's also willing to talk to you help me understand that uh, a neurodivergent person tends to have behavior patterns that aren't perceived as normal so if you look at a neurodivergent person and tell them you need to teach other neurodivergent people how to behave normally that's not professional and that creates a hostile work environment I'm also concerned. What was, what was sorry, that one's name? Emma. She's still with us. No, she has since left the district. I'm also concerned, given the pattern of behavior towards young female teachers, that his behavior, sexism, and hostile work environment could impact our students and become their learning environment. Care to elaborate? If your tendency is to say inappropriate things to young women like the women I've just spoken about. And you are working with 18 or 19 year old girls, young adults, young women. What makes the difference? Because the power differential between a principal and a teacher is already one that's not an even keel. But if you take the power of a principal and a student and he's doing the same things to them, and I was afraid for two years to come to you I don't think it's out of the question to be concerned that that could also impact young women on our campus, especially because most of these women were younger than 25. I'm pretty sure all of them are younger than 30. And he is okay mistreating them and creating a hostile work environment for them. Give me an example of the mistreatment. I just gave you several. I, I specifically to young to young women or the women who work for him I'm talking about first or second year teachers I'm talking about 21 22 23 year old teachers he works with people who are only two years younger than that okay. if he is okay treating me as a professional and creating a hostile work environment for me and my colleagues how can I not be concerned that that is also something that is going to impact young women at our high school Okay.